All right, so in this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to create a random topic generator. And to get started, we're gonna go straight to our XML file and just change it up a bit. I changed it to a relative layout and uh, I changed the text to tap me. Then we're gonna to wanna to center it in parent and give it an ID such as TV underscore topic. And finally, we can add a nice text size and a text color just to make it stand out a little bit more. And finally, that is actually it. I'm just gonna organize it a little bit by doing command shift L, which is a nice little shortcut there. Then we are going to want to go to our main activity and create a list, a mutable list, or actually you can even create an array list or a normal list, but I just went with mutable list here. And here's where you actually enter your topics. I named, I just went ahead and did topic one, topic two, topic three, topic four. So you can do that real quick or you can actually place in your own custom texts. And that's very fast and simple, but the next thing you want to do is create a private function to make things nice and tidy. I named it generate topic. And the first thing you are going to want to do in here is actually create an on click listener for our text view topic. And you do that by clicking on a writing set on click listener and inside set on click listener, we are going to create another value as random. And this is going to generate the random number. We're going to do zero until our uh, mutable list and we're going to put size and using until just saves us a lot of time instead of writing zero to uh, topic list size minus one, it just gets rid of that. So TV topic text and write topic list and we're going to put the index at random. So it's only going to generate numbers of the amount of items we have in the list. Then we can just take our function and place it in our uh, on create method and write generate topic. And as you can see there, every time you click on topic, it will change to a different topic. You can actually make this a bit nicer with animations and stuff, but uh, yeah, that's the basic concept behind a random topic generator. And I really hope this video helped in some way. It was very simple, like a lot of my tutorials, but uh, hopefully we'll make them a little bit more complex in the near future. I just want to get a few more simple concepts out there. And if you have any ideas or any questions about how to do something, I would be more than happy to research it. So please leave a comment if you need help with anything. And uh, I'll see you in the next video.